Good evening YouTube, welcome to my gym. It's actually my garage, but it's a gym as well. Anyway, this is an AWA CS880 boombox. I've just finished uh, doing it up for a friend of mine. Unfortunately, one of the uh, covers for the um, record switch was missing. Um, it was just buzzing and it turned out to be um, dry solder joints on the four earth tags on this switch. So I've resoldered the switches, plus the others weren't that good, so I've redone those as well. Treated it to switch cleaner. Um, the cassette deck was completely non-functional. The um, capstan belt had uh, gone very gooey. The um, there was another drive belt which was, was okay, but I've changed that. And uh, capstan, sorry, no, the uh, the counter belt which had completely disintegrated. But uh, I've got a funny feeling someone else has already been inside the machine before I got to it because I just cannot get the thing to fast forward. There's um like an, an idler gear which doesn't quite engage. I can engage it if I. Uh, give it a helping hand with a screwdriver. I've taken the mechanism to bits. I can't find out what it is, but someone's definitely been in this box before me because for some reason the speaker wires have been cut and taped up. God knows why. However, I've got it back working. He's got a fully functional rewind, nice strong rewind, plays fine. <laughs> Just no fast forward. Well, it does sometimes, but you can hear it working. But to be absolutely honest, these mechanisms, if you take them apart, uh, you just open up a can of worms, to be honest with you. So I've done my best with it. I can't do any more, but it plays. <laughs> it's a lovely machine. I wouldn't mind one of these myself. Dolby noise reduction, which works on the record as well as playback, because I've tried it. The recordings on this machine is uh, pretty good for a boombox. Um, it has a, this isn't a powered speaker, it's just a passive radiator. Sounds extremely good. There's a fellow um, London-based driver, I took a intermodal train down to London a few weeks ago. He was my relief. And standing there under his arm was this. He knew I do he uh, he knew I tinkered with them. So he asked me if I could have a look at it for him. So I brought it back on the train I worked back. And uh, a couple of weeks on I've managed to get it working. I think he's got some more he wants to uh, for me to have a look at so I'll He's going to come up and bring some more up for me. He's also got a JVC machine, which he's going to give to me for doing this job. I'd rather have another boombox than money any day. There we are. Anyway, here's a quick look at my gym. Iron Master dumbbells, power rack, Olympic bar. I got Olympic plates, easy bar. I need to sort that mirror out. I need to get another mirror. They're the acrylic ones, they're rubbish. Uh, safety squat bar. Um, there's a toilet there, but on top of the toilet is a sissy squat bench and a pre it's a sissy squat combined preacher. Um, one cable machine from Mirafit, low pulley, mid pulley, and a high pulley. 
And uh, cardio is a Life Fitness 9100 cross trainer. Another spare bench, I need to stow that away somewhere. And my usual system is a Akai amplifier tuner, three head cassette deck. I've also got a Google uh, audio cast device to it. Uh, Bowles and Wilkins DM110s on the wall. And one TV with a Google Chromecast for doing my cardio. So um, yeah, that's the gym. So I had a shoulder session today. And this was my entertainment. Anyway, YouTube, I'll be back again with some more vintage junk. Bye for now.